Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Here we go. Okay, before I fire up the bandsaw, and yes, I did take four years of wood shop in high school, so we're good. I know how to use a bandsaw. And let me first run you down the Nike Vaporfly 4% Fly Knit. That's the orange shoe. The Nike Next% percent is the green shoe, okay? Now, the 4% shoe, I can't believe it. I've been yearning. I've been so curious to see what is inside the Nike Vaporfly 4% Fly Knit for 18 months since I bought it way back in 2018. Now, I've owned the Nike Next% percent for about five months. Uh, that's the green shoe. It was the next iteration of the 4% lineup called the Next%. Percent. Okay, here we go stats for you uh the the four percent the orange shoe is a 10 millimeter drop okay so from heel to toe 10 millimeter drop 31 millimeter stack height in the heel 21 in the forefoot of course it's got that carbon fiber plate in the zoom x foam inside the midsole so you better believe we're going to be cutting through that carbon fiber plate hopefully the bandsaw can handle it uh what else it's a fly knit upper uh, so it's a, that's actually going to be probably the toughest material out of the shoe to cut through is my guess. So keep an eye out for that fly knit, that orange upper. How does the saw do cutting through the, uh, that fly knit upper? And then what else? Oh yeah, it's coming in at 6.8 ounces in men's size 9. And the outsole is a rubber outsole, uh, which changed quite a bit for the next percent. So the next percent, they actually dropped the drop from 10 millimeters down to eight millimeters so they dropped it by two and the stack height went up quite considerably to 40 millimeters in the heel 32 in the forefoot and they dropped the weight by 0.2 ounces so 6.6 ounces again in men's size nine but here's what's crazy everybody is that there's 15 percent more zoom x foam inside the midsole of the next percent so again, we shall see how the bandsaw cuts through that midsole foam. And then I guess I'll just point out the outsole pattern on the bottom of the next percent. The green shoe changed quite a bit, a little more grip for those wet roads out there. Now, real quick, uh, yes, I'm giving away not one, two pairs of Nike next percents. Got to stay tuned, though. I will let you know how to enter your name into the drawing for the Nike Next Percent at the end of the video. So watch the whole thing. Okay, I think that's it. Again, four years of wood shop. Roll the tape. Butter it, butter it, ladies and gentlemen. There we go. Oh man, butter my bread. If I ever have said so in my life, that Nike Vaporfly 4% fly knit right there and the Nike Next Percent, the cross sections. I, uh, that was insane, a little insane. The first one was kind of tough actually. Actually, it might've been this one. Look at that upper, that fly knit. Remember I said, watch the upper 
as it uh, that bandsaw did I must say it was like cutting through butter, butter actually the bandsaw did great and all right we're gonna put that guy up there and this guy there let's break it down let's analyze as best we can the uh, the functionality that Nike has put into both of these shoes again the 2018 iteration 2019 and okay real quick let me just grab the carbon fiber plates here that was also pretty neat uh trying to expose as best I could the there they are there it is so I didn't quite go right down the middle on both of the shoes I just wanted to make sure I didn't lose a finger but there's the exposed carbon fiber plate on the on the four percent and there it is on the next percent and why am I giving away two pairs of Nike next percents basically everyone I don't like to waste things and I just cut apart two really nice shoes okay I feel a little bad about it therefore that's why I want to buy two people out there two fresh brand new pairs of Nike next percents but this is not going to waste this is science ladies and gentlemen this is science now we can break this down analyze and figure out okay what is going on inside the midsoles of both of these shoes all right now let's break these down starting from the uppers right down to the outsole first of all I don't think I mentioned that the vapor weave the green on top of the shoe here that is a brand new material from Nike very water repellent doesn't absorb water uh, whereas as you can tell look at that fly knit much much different material on the fly knit and it was much easier just like butter to cut through that vapor weave it was like nothing the bandsaw went right through it what I noticed next is that uh, just below the insole the material definitely is a little more rubber rubber based on this uh, insole here and you can see it on your screen close up versus the uh, material just below the insole it's more of a fabric based in the next percent so I noticed that immediately after cutting it open now moving on to the midsole you can see immediately that there's a lot more zoom X foam wrapped around that carbon fiber plate in that uh, in the next percent here on the top versus the four percent on the bottom now another difference that I'm noticing immediately is the carbon fiber plate in the four percent the orange one is there's not as, as much zoom X foam above the carbon fiber plate compared to the next percent and I must just say I'll just say a little anecdote here my Amsterdam Marathon it was quite a my feet hurt quite a bit more afterward now I did run quite a bit faster in the first half marathon but who knows maybe the carbon fiber plates being a little closer to the insole of the shoe made a difference as to why my feet hurt quite a bit more so that's interesting uh, just to see the positioning of the carbon fiber plate in that cross section and moving on to the actual carbon fiber plate now I know I cut right down the middle of it but uh, I wanted that full cross section effect that's why I went straight down the middle uh, what you're looking at right here just that and I'm gonna you better believe I'm gonna save these forever uh, just to continue to analyze and yes compare to other carbon fiber plates down the road but uh, there they are and I'm not too shocked at the shape of the carbon fiber plates um, and even just the feel of them like just like feeling it yeah I mean it feels pretty plasticky and you know what I'm saying is that a word uh, but I'm just like and I probably will deconstruct this even more who knows maybe even tomorrow just to really feel out like okay how much spring is really in this thing so anyway there you go there's the carbon fiber plates and last but not least moving on to the outsole so I'm actually intrigued I'm intrigued it looks man actually this is kind of crazy um to me just looking at it hold on let me get another one one second here just looking at it everybody okay that looks a little more compare anyway the thickness of the outsole the actual rubber under your forefoot it looks pretty even now now that I'm looking at it a little closer and I'll do a little bit a little closer measurement here in a, in a minute okay there you have it everyone there are the remnants of the Nike Vaporfly 4% flying it and the Nike next percent such a cool day something new on the vlog and again I'm saving all of this material forever we will continue to break it down analyze for all of you and who knows like other carbon fiber plates the you know the carbon uh, the carbon rocket the carbon X there's other carbon fiber plates arriving onto the scene rapidly from other companies as well and yes the question of the day who owns either of these shoes the four percent or the next percent and what is your opinion on the technological advancements that are happening in 
marathon racing shoes right now, even though you can use these shoes for other distances as, as well. But so that's the question of the day. What's your opinion on all this advancement? Um, I hope you enjoyed that craziness, craziness. I just, uh, it was awesome. Okay, running shoe giveaway. Here we go. Nike next percent, two pairs I'm gonna give, a, give away. Why? Because I destroyed two pairs of running shoes today and I don't like to waste. I honestly don't like to waste, but I hope that we can learn together as I continue to analyze and break down these shoes. So as this channel grows, I'm ever grateful, but I would love to be able to help more people through the running shoe giveaways. Therefore, to enter your name into the Nike Next Percent giveaway, I would love to see this vlog go far and wide, far and wide, all over the interwebs, okay? So you got three options to enter your name. You, if you do all three options, you increase your odds, but you have to do at least one. And yes, it has to do with social media and sharing this vlog. Why? Because I'd love to see all these shoes given away to people in need and to see this channel continue to grow because I think we've got something special here in the Demore Global Running. As you can see back there in the banner, seek beauty, work hard, and love each other. Okay, three options. Here we go. Option number one, Instagram. Take a screenshot of you watching this vlog and maybe take a picture of your TV, post it to your story and link to this vlog, okay? It's that simple, all right? Just an Instagram story, that simple. Option two, Twitter, everyone out there on Twitter, all you have to do is retweet the vlog. I will post it and pin it to my profile on Twitter. Twitter. All you have to do is hit retweet, all right? It's that simple and your name is entered. Option three, of course, Facebook. So I will post on the Facebook page down below in the description a link to the page and then you go to the post at the top. It'll be pinned and it'll be linked again to this blog right here that you're watching right now. Go share it wherever you want, either on your profile or on another page, wherever you want on Facebook and you will be entered. With that said, I think that's it. Oh, I love you all. I can't wait. Oh yeah, you've got 48 hours, 48 hours to share this vlog all over the place. So I will announce the winner on, when you're watching this on Wednesday, so it'll be, it'll be Friday night. Friday night, I will draw out two names from all the people that share the vlog. Amazing, oh, it's gonna be epic. I will announce all over so social media. You won't miss it. And of course, here on YouTube. Thanks for being here, thanks for watching. You guys rock. All right, you better believe we're gonna toss it back to the full review of the Nike Vaporfly 4% flying it on the right and the full review of the Nike Next Percent on the left. Check out those vlogs if you're interested in learning more about both of these shoes. Boom, seek beauty, work hard, and love each other. See you tomorrow.